Hello everybody, this is Dan from Macklin Ford. And in this video, I am showing you this 2021 Ford F-150. It's in the Lariat trim. It's equipped with spotlight mirrors, blind spot information system, rails, remote keyless entry pad, the sport appearance package, an exterior rear dome light, trailer tow package, spray in bed liner, and power release tailgate. Moving to the back seat, we do have the power window controls, as well as a leather bench seat uh, that will fit three people, or you can pull down the center console for a couple of cup holders. Now this is also a split folding bench seat, so if you do need a little bit of extra cargo space, you can have it. On top of that, we do have some seat back storage, as well as a couple of cup holders there. Um, the bench seat is a heated seat, so you got uh, the heated seat controls there, 12 volt outlet, as well as two USB ports and a 110 volt outlet. And moving up to the driver's door, we do have the power window controls, including the one push down for the front windows. And we have the power window, um, power mirror controls, which are also folding. And we have the power lock as, as well, and uh, the um, memory seat controls. Now just on the inside, and we do have the uh, controls for your spotlights, your mirror spotlights, your power tailgate release, as well as, as the controls for your automatic headlights, which do include fog lights, and then your exterior rear dome light. Then you have your electronic parking brake, as well as the controls for your power adjustable pedals. Okay, taking a look at the driver's seat here, you know, we also see that it is fully... Okay, moving up to the driver's seat, taking a look at the steering wheel. On the left-hand side, we do have the sync voice activated system button, your steering wheel mounted audio controls, as well as the buttons for your adaptive cruise control. On the right-hand side, you do have your phone buttons, as well as the buttons for your dashboard menu. Now, taking a look at your dash, we see that this F-150 has 17,734 kilometers on it, and your menu, you can select from my view, trip, truck, towing, uh, navigation, phone, audio settings, as well as vehicle settings. Just on the right side of the steering column here, you have your push-button ignition. Right beside that, you have your Pro Trailer Backup Assist, uh, trailer brake controls, as well as your 4x4 controls. Now, taking a look just above uh, the center display screen, uh, we have several buttons over here. I include the auto stop, uh, the auto start stop off button, your uh, camera button here, so it will show you your camera, uh, your hazard light button, as well as your anti-skate off button. Uh, you will also see that this F-150 is equipped uh, with a sound system from BNO for excellent sound quality. Now, taking a look at your display screen, it is a touch screen, and so your radio here will accept uh, sources from AM, FM, Sirius, as well as Bluetooth, and that's where you would add a new phone. Okay. Uh, you do have a navigation system as well, so you don't get lost. Okay. You can add or edit any of your favorite uh, buttons over here. And you do have uh, some vehicle apps as well, including Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Okay. You have your vehicle settings over here, which do include system updates, Ford Assistant, Valet Mode, 911 Assist, as well as features, which do include zone lighting, towing, as well as the digital owner's manual. Now, shifting into reverse, we do see the, the camera view again. Now, you can change uh, the focus there to, to your trailer hitch. And you'll also see that uh, this F-150 does have a reverse uh, sensing system. Now, just below the screen, you do have your physical controls for your radio as well as your climate system, which do include heated and ventilated front seats, as well as a heated steering wheel. Uh, and right beside these controls, you do have a 12 volt outlet as well as a 110 volt outlet. And then right below those controls, you have a little cubby hole here for some small uh, storage as well as two USB ports. Now you can close this area up so that uh, it's not seen from outside, providing a little bit of uh, security. Now moving back, you have a couple of cup holders over here as well as your gear selector, which does have select shift. And with the touch of the button, you can um, make that gear selector recess into the uh, console area, which will turn this area into a, a bit of a work area. Thanks for watching. For more information on this F-150, give us a call at 587-871-8293 and quote stock number 21P5158. You can also come on down in person at 135 Glendeer Circle Southeast. We would love to see you. Have yourself a wonderful day.